Hello and welcome to video one of the Elvis Presley Uke Challenge. So we're learning 10 Elvis Presley songs in one month. And there's a free printable down below for you. So go ahead and grab that PDF so you can follow along. Make sure your ukulele is tuned. Take a few deep breaths. Roll the shoulders back. Unfold yourself if you've been kind of hunched over your instrument. Unfold. And the first song we're doing, as you can tell from the title, is Can't Help Falling in Love. This song, I would like for you to count one, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. And you can give me down strums if you're more of a beginner. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then you'll switch to the next chord. And if you're a little bit more advanced or you want to be a little bit more advanced and you're daring enough to try, go ahead and assign one finger per string. So I'm going to put G um, on the thumb on G string and then the index on C, middle on E and ring finger on A. And I'm going to play strings G, C, E, A, E, C. And that just conveniently gives us the six beats that we need. One, two, three, four, five, six. So this is what I'm going to be doing with the C chord for the intro. For the intro, we will need C, G, back to C. One, two. Every time you see a chord listed on the screen, give it six beats. So let's try that intro together. If you're more of a beginner, give me those gentle down strokes. Look up, go ahead and keep the down strokes really close to the strings. Don't make a wide um, strum uh, motion because that's going to be too strong for the feel of the song. Here we go. One, two, three. Four, five, six, one, two, three, four, G, back to C, C again, really great, let's do it one more time just so that we continue to warm ourselves up, here we go, one, two, three, four, five, six, one, two, four, G chord, one, two, three, four, five, back to C, one more C, Great, you've got the intro, so now let's learn the next part. In this next section, the lyrics come in, but we're gonna play without the lyrics first because I would love for you to master the chord switches. There's quite a few chords in here and they move pretty fast every six beats. For that first chord switch, I would love it if you played C with the middle finger and then have your index finger on the second fret kind of on deck, ready to go because that'll make that switch to E minor so much easier. So you can play that C and then your index finger is ready to go. The middle finger just moves up a string and then you lay down the ring finger. If you're more of a beginner, play on beats one and four of every chord like this. Look up. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, and if you're a little beyond that, then you can do the strumming. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One. And if you can do the finger picking, that would be the best. That's what we're aiming for. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. Okay? So I'll give you six beats and then we'll all come in together to play this section. Breathe. There we go, that's better. One, two, three, ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. This one happens twice. Next chord, go. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five, six. 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 
you notice those last four chords in the verse equal the intro so you already know that section if there's a part of the song that's going to help you improve as an ukulele player and it's going to take you to the next level it's going to be this section so for this section we start on an e minor and then we're going to hop with all fingers over one string closer to your face to a b7 and then hop back to e minor and then back to b7 and this happens a few times and it's not easy right because you have to move all of your fingers they're not staying in the same string so go ahead and look at your ukulele and do this without the strumming or the picking just do this little hop and keep the thumb well behind the instrument to give you that extra length that you'll need to reach the fourth fret of G string here that we're reaching with a B7. So one, two, three, four, five, switch. 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 So that's the most challenging part of the whole song. You can do this, you can do the whole song. So again, if you're more of a beginner, just play on beats one and four. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. If you're pretty on that, give me the strum. But keep those strums gentle, true to the song. And if you're more advanced, give me the finger picking. One, two, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two. Here it's extra challenging on that finger picking because we have to reach that fourth fret quickly. Okay, so let's try this section. Notice the other chords that we'll need, but you can do these. You can do this. Here we go. One, two, three, ready, go. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, put your ukuleles down. Roll the shoulders back. So, so far we've done three different sections in this tutorial. We've done the intro, C, G, C, C. We've done the section that where the lyrics first come in, wise man say. And then we just did right now the like a river flows section. These are the only three sections in the song. The rest of the song repeats some part of this and that's it. So you have learned how to play the song already. So let's do this. Let's start from the top and do the intro, a wise man say section and a like a river flows section. And for my Patreon members, you're gonna have a full play along from beginning to end with the intro and a little outro. Okay, so get ready. The singing notes are what? no, wise man. There we go, it's a C and a G. Once the singing comes in, wise man. Let's try it. One, two, three, ready, go, C. G, C chord, C again. Add the words, wise, man, say, only fools, but Okay, so now let's go to the next section, the singing notes when I'm holding an E minor. Like the river flows. Okay, this is a little more challenging on the voice. Here we go. One, two, three, ready, go. Like the river flows. just finished 
watching the first tutorial video for the first song on the Elvis Uke challenge. So pat yourself on the back. This was not easy. This was challenging. If you would like the full play along from beginning to end, I'll post that on my Patreon page. And if you would like the principle that's free for everyone, make sure you're checking down below. And if you want to support the channel in any way possible, hit the like button, subscribe, hit the bell, leave a comment. All of these little buttons help support the channel a lot. And you can join the Patreon fam or you can shop in my store, Euglandia Shop. So there's lots of ways to support the channel, but really the best way to support is to watch the tutorials and participate with the playing. And once you're playing, teach other people how to do it and bring them back to the channel and grow the family. I'm really looking forward to seeing your covers, whether you post on Instagram or on Facebook, make sure you tag me. I love, that's my favorite part of the, oh, my cheeks hurt, I'm smiling so much. But that's my favorite part of the 30 day uke challenges is when I get to watch your videos. So please tag me and I'll see you for video two. Ciao.